Ever wondered what those digital coins your tech-savvy friend keeps rambling about are? Well, brace yourselves, we're diving into the world of Bitcoin today. Imagine a world where your money isn't controlled by banks or governments. Welcome to the realm of Bitcoin, a cryptocurrency or digital form of money that operates independently of any central authority. Bitcoin is like your regular money, but on steroids, and it's been around a lot longer than you might think. In 2009, an enigmatic entity known only as Satoshi Nakamoto introduced Bitcoin to the public. This anonymous creator or group of creators gave birth to what has become the most recognized cryptocurrency in the world. Bitcoin, the digital gold, has been shaking the financial world for over a decade. So, Bitcoin is this digital gold that's been shaking the financial world since 2009. But how does it work? Let's find out. But before we get to that, hit the like button, leave a comment on your thoughts and subscribe. Now imagine a world where you don't need banks to make transactions. Sounds thrilling, doesn't it? That's the world Bitcoin brings to life. Now let's dive into the fascinating mechanics of Bitcoin. At the heart of Bitcoin lies the blockchain. Picture this, a transparent public ledger that records all Bitcoin transactions. It's like a giant communal spreadsheet where everyone can see what's going on, but no one can alter an entry once it's made. This transparency fosters trust and eliminates the need for a central authority. So how does a transaction actually work? Well, it's a three-step process. First, someone requests a transaction. Then, the requested transaction is broadcasted to a network of computers known as nodes. Finally, these nodes validate the transaction and the user's status with the help of known algorithms. Once verified, the transaction is combined with others to create a new block of data for the ledger. Now, you might be wondering, but who does all this heavy computational work? Well, meet the miners. These are not your traditional gold diggers, but they're digging for something just as valuable, if not more, Bitcoin. These powerful computers compete to solve complex mathematical problems. The first to crack it gets to add a new block to the blockchain and is rewarded with Bitcoin. This process, known as mining, is how new Bitcoins are brought into circulation. However, it's not all fun and games. Mining requires a substantial amount of computational power and energy, which makes it an intense and costly process. But the allure of earning Bitcoin makes it worthwhile for many. So essentially, Bitcoin is a blend of math, computers, and a sprinkle of magic, creating a unique financial system. But what's the catch? Remember how your parents halved your candy when you were a kid to make it last? Well, Bitcoin does something similar, only instead of candy, it's a reward a digital treasure that miners earn for verifying transactions on the Bitcoin network. This is known as Bitcoin halving, and it's a pretty big deal in the cryptocurrency world. You see, when Bitcoin first entered the scene in 2009, the reward for mining a block was 50 Bitcoins. A pretty sweet deal, right? But just like your parents with your Halloween candy stash, Bitcoin decided to start halving the rewards. This happens approximately every four years or every 210,000 blocks to be precise. The most recent halving took place in May of 2020, bringing the reward down to a still respectable 6.25 bitcoins. And just like clockwork, we're expecting another halving around 2024. This time, the reward will shrink to a mere 3.125 bitcoins. Now you might be thinking, that's a bummer. Why would anyone want less reward? But here's the kicker. As the reward decreases, the value of bitcoin tends to increase. It's a bit like having a limited edition collectible, the fewer there are, the more valuable they become. So, like that everlasting gobstopper, the Bitcoin reward keeps shrinking, making it even more valuable over time. But what's the big deal about Bitcoin? Ever thought about buying a pizza with Bitcoin? Well, someone did, and it's now worth millions. Yes, you heard that right. In May 2010, a programmer named Laszlo Hanyec made the first real-world transaction using Bitcoin by purchasing two pizzas for 10,000 Bitcoins. Today, those pizzas would be worth a mouth-watering sum of over $400 million. This story serves as a perfect illustration of the meteoric rise and profound impact of Bitcoin on the global financial landscape. But what exactly is this impact, you ask? Let's delve into that. The introduction of Bitcoin marked the birth of a new era in finance. It's a decentralized digital currency that operates without the need for a central bank or single administrator. It's a peer-to-peer -peer network where transactions take place directly between users, without an intermediary. This revolutionary concept has significantly disrupted traditional financial systems, prompting a re-evaluation of how we perceive and use money. One of the most notable impacts of Bitcoin is its challenge to the traditional banking system. 
Bitcoin's decentralized nature means that it's not controlled by any government or financial institution. This decentralization has given control back to the people, allowing them to manage their own finances without the need for banks or other financial intermediaries. Bitcoin has also opened up a world of new possibilities for global transactions. With Bitcoin, you can send money to anyone, anywhere in the world, at any time, and for a fraction of the cost of traditional money transfer services. This has made cross-border transactions faster, cheaper, and more efficient. However, it's not all sunshine and rainbows. Bitcoin's volatility can lead to significant price swings, and its anonymous nature can potentially facilitate illegal activities. These are challenges that need to be addressed as we continue to explore the potential of this groundbreaking technology. Bitcoin's impact extends beyond finance. Its underlying technology, blockchain, has found applications in various industries, including healthcare, supply chain management, and even voting systems. The possibilities are endless, and we're only just scratching the surface. So what does the future hold for Bitcoin? Well, it's hard to say for certain. But one thing's for sure, Bitcoin has already left an indelible mark on the world, and its impact will continue to be felt for years to come. If you want to see more videos of Bitcoin or cryptocurrency, leave a comment more crypto so I can do more of these. So, next time you think about spending your Bitcoin on a pizza, remember, you might just be biting into a future fortune. Until next time, keep exploring the fascinating world of Bitcoin.